Hello and welcome to the first Grade 9 episode of Grammar TV for 2021. My name is Evie Norton. And I'm Will Crawford. Isn't it just so exciting to be back at school, Will? I don't know about that one, Evie. Anyway, Grade 8 is a very exciting year for many students. The introduction into the rest of the school may be exciting for some. Others may find it daunting. Minnie Calvert, Ava Jones and Lucy MacArthur conducted a few interviews with some Grade 8 students. Lucy MacArthur, Ava Jones and I interviewed some Grade 8s and found out a little bit about how they're feeling moving up out of the log cabins and into the bigger parts of the school. Here's what they had to say. I guess there has been a lot that has changed since being in the log cabins. Um, you've become a lot more independent, um, like using the lockers. Yeah. At first it was quite hard to use my locker because I couldn't change the lock. It's not been easy using the lockers. That is hard. Yeah. I've managed to get to my classes on time and found my way around school. So excited for the year ahead. Yeah. Camp. Um, like every opportunity. Sport, yeah, opportunities. With a new year comes new teachers. Grace Robertson spoke to Mrs Pickering, the new head of Gillett, to learn how she's settling into her new role. This year at Grammar we have welcomed a new house head for Gillett, Mrs Anne Pickering. She comes to us from the Abbotsley School in Sydney with many years of experience. I interviewed her last week about her transition to Grammar and her outlines for Gillett this year. I'm actually finding the transition fairly easy. Uh, my last school was at a girls' school. Uh, it was very intense and I'm really enjoying uh, how at Grandma it's, it's a little freer and uh, more fun. One of the things that I thought very carefully about before I came was that it's really important for me to actually get to know the members of Gillette House before I come up with any uh, big ideas about about what I do. I do have a few ideas but pretty much for me it's about getting to know who's in the house and uh, finding out what's going to be most helpful for them. Mrs Pickering has thoroughly enjoyed her time at Grammar so far. In Gillette she is looking forward to building relationships with the students and as a whole being a part of the Grammar community. This has been Grace Robertson for Grammar TV. Now, let's talk about the canteen. Recently, some concern has been levied over canteen prices steadily rising over the last few years. Simon Haberley decided to find out why. ...has been providing students with cheaper and healthier alternatives to packed lunch. But some students have made some complaints about the rising prices. Um, recently, the, uh, the price has went up like 10 cents. I was talking to the canteen staff about it. Um, I don't know, they just went up, so I don't know why. With COVID, because a lot of stuff has to be packaged now, that is also an extra cost. So each year, everything's going to keep probably going up because the people we buy it off put their prices up. Well, you're paying less than what you would be at the supermarket and at a lot of takeaway shops. You are paying a lot less. While some may think these prices are steep, the canteen provides us with healthy food options at reasonable prices. I think we're the best, come on. I reckon we're the best canteen in Australia. Because one, I've got the best customers in Australia. Compared to what it was before, where it's just, um, you know, just this tiny little dingy thing. But yeah, it's not too bad. It's pretty good. Simon Haberley, Grammar TV. It seems we are actually pretty lucky with our canteen prices. I agree. We now have a tennis update, brought to you by Nixon Wade. Here at Grammar, we are very passionate about our sport, one of which is the sport of tennis. Last year, throughout a COVID plague season, we managed to make the best of the challenging circumstances. I will now pass over to Mr Finch, the head of sport, and Harry Booth, tennis captain, to see how tennis looks this year here at Grammar. In Term 1, our senior students uh, train on a Tuesday morning uh, with James Bozzanello down at the Launceston Tennis Centre. Uh, we also have an opportunity for our, our younger students, our 7s to 10s, to, to train on Tuesday and Thursday lunchtime with Matthew Carswell. 
Uh, it's looking pretty good at the moment. Uh, we'll probably get to the finals, and the second's really strong, I think, and throughout the next few years, we should have a really strong team. This has been Nixon Wade for Grammar TV. All the best for tennis this year. Well, that concludes this episode of Grammar TV for 2021. Make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.